no! Ugh. More on that in a bit. But first, I'm Luke Monis. Welcome to The Loop. The show critics are calling online. Today I'm showing you game shows from Japan that would probably be illegal in America, sharding sharks, and much more. But first, sports! This week, the Cavs closed out the Pacers. This is my favorite clip from the series. Wow, he just really wanted to high-five LeBron. That broke my heart watching that. He almost looks happier to not have gotten the high-five. He's like, it's cool, yes! I got it, it's fine! LeBron is so famous that you can go viral from almost getting a high-five from him. However, this is nothing new for LeBron. Final five minutes, and it'll be a stat we'll watch all season long. A little sh Please! Shake my hand! This isn't a job fair, you know? LeBron, how are you? I'm Tom Stevenson. I sell printers. Is that a handshake or is he trying to rescue him? He's like, LeBron, get in the boat! Get in the boat, your team is sinking! Pretty good, pretty good reference. Nobody got it, that's fine. I wanna thank my unemployed friends for being in my base at the time. So we had a Fortnite first this week. I snatched this dude's wig so hard I changed his hairstyle. Watch this. <laughs> what, is this real? He got his headshot so hard that his hairstyle changed? That cannot be a thing, okay? Stranger Things season three is finally underway. Wait, I'm confused. Is season three just a cast reunion party? What's happening here? Have you ever seen a more epic trailer for just a group of kids reading? <laughs> in a world where children are sitting at a table <laughs> and proper name tags are applied <laughs> and scripts are stapled, one man does this voice for too long. <laughs> Avengers Infinity War premiered last weekend and Benedict Cumberbatch, AKA Doctor Strange, went on Ellen to promote it. Exactly, you right, know, you know right. it's, oh, it's okay, that's fake blood. Right, yeah. Although I, I'm still right. very susceptible. Ah! Oh! oh my God, that scared me. Well, good thing that prank worked because that guy has been in that box for eight days. Water, water. I had to go to the bathroom in there. Don't go in the box. It's bad. It's getting hot out just when you thought it was safe to go back in the water. Oh, 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 oh no, no. If I was there, the shark would not be the only one crapping himself. <laughs> and just like that, the cage goes from being your protection to the thing that traps you inside a cloud of shark poop. <laughs> Get me out of here! My scuba suit is compromised! <laughs> also this week, we have an amazing slow-mo video from Legendary Shots. Uh. Oh. Oh. Why? <laughs> the hold is good, it's up, and bruise! making the score this guy zero and bad idea with three points on the board. Next up, we have a viral clip that proves that being a ball boy is not as fun as it sounds. Oh. <laughs> Mondays, am I right? He didn't even trip. He was just like, all right, I stopped and I'm gonna fall. I've never seen someone with a concussion act so composed. They're just like, Whoa, those stars from Looney Tunes, that's crazy. <laughs> and now, for the very bizarre world of foreign game shows. This is the pop-off. <laughs> First, everybody, I want to welcome my guests, two very funny comedians, Usama Siddiqui. <laughs> yes, and Mamadou and Jai. <laughs> Why is it always louder? Why is it? <laughs> he got way bigger applause. Uh, it's always louder. Yeah, okay, well, welcome to my basement, guys. Thanks for having me. Thanks for having us. Of course, absolutely. You don't seem creeped out by that at all. <laughs> no, no, this is fine. I've been in basements before, so. <laughs> First up, this video of a Japanese game show was all over Reddit this week. Oh! Oh, no, no, no. oh my god! Yo, oh. yo you, you better hope I die. You better hope I die. So that, oh, that is a rough way to start your work week. I wasn't ready for the craziness to start that quick. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I was like, okay, we're gonna chill. It's like falling down the elevator is enough. Do you have to go down a mucus water slide? <laughs> right, right. 
I feel like the Japanese game show, they'd be like weirded out if it wasn't though. Right. If they, they came out, where's the mucus though? Huh? Uh, 100% delete my number if you do this to me. Cause like, we're not friends anymore. Why is she smiling? Cause she's alive, bro. Like, <laughs> like cause if I was falling down an elevator and I was like, oh, I'm good. oh wait, I'm good. It's just mucus. Isn't it crazy? It's like, I have, I have a talk show. I'm interviewing people. Yeah. I'm, t I'm looking at the camera. In reality, people would just prefer if I just fell down an elevator. <laughs> my question is who pitched this? Who? <laughs> who, wa who walked into Japanese ABC and was like, yo. You know, you know it's, it's crazy? Like, he pitched it, right? Yeah. He was pitching it, and they're all like, I don't know. And then he's like, wait, tools a page up? Just the word mucus is everywhere. <laughs> Wow, oh my god, I'm so sorry. Man. It's gonna be like Seinfeld, but for us. <laughs> Crazy. I think I was so blown away by this that my only question was, what else is out there? <laughs> Bro, I'm still stuck on his hair. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, no, bruh. No, no, go, go, don't do it, don't do it. Yo, it's dental free? Cause like, they is out here biting very hard objects. Don't, oh, my teeth hurt. This is suggestive, actually. Oh! You know what's so funny is that like, at first we're like weirded out, right. but then within two clips we're like, yeah, it's edible! We like bind their world so quick. It's crazy because I played this same game in my office last week. <laughs> I'm sorry, Ron, I have to replace your stapler. <laughs> was it edible though? <laughs> no, it was a real stapler. At what point in the digestive process did you find out that it was a real stapler? <laughs> just this morning. No. <laughs> I think it's just a good lesson for life. It's like, remember kids, bite into everything because it might be candy. <laughs> you never know. The thing is, like, this is all happening in Japan where, like, there's no, like, Tide Pod challenge that'll come out of it. Like, here people will eat, like, someone will eat something and then be like, oh, everyone's got to eat it. But, like, in Japan, not everyone's out here, like, you know, biting doorknobs. My thing is, like, the Tide Pod is like, oh, Americans eating Tide Pods. This is a crisis. And Japanese is like, episode one, Tide Pods. <laughs> it's like, that's, that's their start of how crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Up next, we have this utterly confusing yet awesome game show from, you guessed it, Japan. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, nah, no. son. Nah, son. No, 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 no. No, stop. Wait, wait. Turn it Bro. off. Wait, she's getting Bro. Turn off the machine. Does she have to answer questions? Oh, no, 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 Okay. Oh, she actually looks pretty cool. If the last show was called Candy or Not Candy, what's this show called? <laughs> this show is called Three Question Marks, and that's it. That's it. I've saved the best for last this clip from a Japanese show called AK Bingo. What is that? Okay. Okay, this is fine. This is just, you know, I don't want to no, be insensitive. Not like this. Oh, her lip. That's so cute. Oh, where did it go? Okay, it's not alive, so. Oh my god, I, I knew exactly what. Oh. Oh. oh! Yo, this is some Batman villain oh. shit. No, 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 no. Oh. Oh. Yo! Yo! Oh, she's so happy! Oh, oh my god! <laughs> No, then it says Chuck E. Cheese, where a kid can be a kid. Like, the box, that's so, oh, oh my shit. god, no! Yo, that's that some, was like, that yo. Was like, <laughs> bro, is that like Japanese Dave and Buster's? Like, that's, that's crazy. Also, do these people go back to their families after this? <laughs> like, you gotta leave Japan. <laughs> So, oh, you're that person who, like, that cockroach went yeah. in their mouth because your lungs are weak. You have the baby yeah. lung. Like, Even oh. if you won, you have to leave. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Well, guys, this has been a lot of fun. I think that's all the time we have for today. Give a round of applause for Usama and Mamadou, everybody. How oh, great were they? Thanks for stopping by. Now it's time for the loop of the week. Here he goes. Oh, look at that. This is the moment he's like, I should switch to golf. That squeak is so loud. After that, all his friends refer to this moment as the big squeak. I've heard of your ankles getting broken, but it broke his whole body. Why dunk it after? The game is over, okay? Let me just say, guys, this would never happen to me, okay? I don't get back on defense fast enough. What's the lesson here? If you find yourself getting crossed so hard that you slide eight feet and land on your butt, just get back up again. Then move to another country, change your name, wait till everything cools down. Come back with a beard, act like nothing happens. I'm Luke Monis, and now you're in the Luke.
All right, guys, that's it for this week. If you want to subscribe, click here. For last week's episode, click right here and click anywhere over here for more from Whistle Sports. And click me for a surprise. <laughs>